some prestidigitation, Ooh, some leisure domain. <laughs> that means some pretty tricky stuff. Yep. But in order for that to work, I'm going to need some assistance, some helpers, some audience volunteers. Now, if you want to be selected, it's very simple. All you have to do is follow some very easy rules. Now, they're easy rules, but if you follow them, chances are we'll bring you up. You can be the star of our show, yeah. You'll win the love and admiration of all of your friends, but, but, and this is your big but. <laughs> you know, nothing personal there, folks, sorry about that. <laughs> You'll also win a lovely party gift, yeah, that's right. <gasps> Prizes for my helpers. So here's the rules if you'd like to help. Rule number one, you must be sitting down flat but straight up. That is rule number one. Yep, right on your bumpers, everybody. Very good. Rule number two, a big smile is needed. That is rule number two. Oh, I guess a good smile out there. Rule number three, you must raise your hand so I can see you. That is rule number three. Aren't you glad you used dial, sweetheart? <laughs> Don't you wish everyone did? Me too. Well, uh, Will, it's okay. It's okay. I've already said it. Yeah, thanks. Uh, but most importantly, rule number four, which is my personal favorite, you must give me, Frank Thurston, $20. Now, bring your money right over here, single file line, no pushing, no showing, ATM cards, Visa, MasterCard, Venmo. <laughs> All right, one of these days that's going to work. You guys are too smart. We'll do it for free. But I tell you what, we're going to start things off today in a rather unusual way. Now, I am not a hypnotist, but when you see this, you might think about hypnosis, but don't worry, gang. We are not going to put you in a trance and make you do something silly like go home and clean your room. No, we're going to show you guys a real, true illusion. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I got to warn you, this is going to happen right inside your very own brains. I hope most of you brought yours with you today. Now, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to start spinning this disc like so. What I want everybody in the audience to do is to keep your eyes focused right there on the dead center. There is a pink spot there. That is your focal point. Keep your eyes on that pink spot and whatever you do, do not look away. Now it's okay to blink, but please don't take your eyes off that pink spot. And let me explain why. In a few seconds, I will count backwards from five to one. And when I get to one, not you. But when I get to one, you will stop looking at the peel and look directly at my nose. Now, if you do, you should see something weird and strange. And I don't just mean my face. Now, you're going to see the illusion that my head will actually appear to shrink down about the size of a softball. So check it out. Keep watching that pink spot as it goes round and round. I'll count backwards from five to one. <gasps> Watch my nose. Here we go. Let's go five, four, three, two, one. Look at my nose. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Big round of applause if you saw that. Isn't that weird? It's kind of creepy, huh? Now, we're going to do it again. We're going to do it again because I don't know why, but for some reason, the second time, it's about a hundred times stronger. So if you didn't see it the first time, yeah, I'm sure you'll see it this time. However, I do need a volunteer to help you. Yep, young gentleman right there in the front. You want him to help Sparky? Come on up. Go right around the side, all the way around the back to the set of stairs over there. And folks, give them a big round of applause. All righty. Hang on. Come on up and join 
Okay, let's find a little something about you. What's your name, my friend? What's your name? Ooh, I'm sorry, that's wrong. You have to go back. No, I'm just kidding. Come here, let me up. Just kidding. It was Brian, right? Oh, Ryan, I'm sorry, Ryan. Everybody say hi, Ryan. Hi. Uh, Ryan, you're going to be one of the stars of the show. These folks are going to yell, scream, and clap, and it's all for you, but you got to look like a star. Ryan, you have to stand there front and center. You have to stand, no, no, you have to stand up. Stand up nice and tall, nice and tall. Eyes straight ahead, eyes straight ahead. Look at that cute girl in the back. That's the one. Good now, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to do this again, only this time. We're going to spin the disc in the opposite direction. Now, again, everybody keep your eyes on that pink spot. But this time, this time, when I count backwards from five to one, you're not going to look at my nose, no, no, no. You're going to look at my friend Ryan's nose. And when you do, you're going to see his head grow to ginormous proportions, like a big balloon inflating. Check it out. This is going to be cool as we count backwards from five to one. Watch his nose. Here we go. Let's go five, four, three, Two, one, look at his nose. Oh. <laughs> Give that boy a big round of applause. That was cool. Good job, Brian. Now, he did a very fine job. He did, and because he did, I have a special surprise for him. <laughs> it's a big bottle of Tylenol for those headaches you're going to get later. <laughs> no, no, no. It's a magical activity book. Oh. Now, what is the magical activity book, you ask? I'm glad you did. Ladies and gentlemen, they are filled with games and puzzles, the history of magic, coloring pages, but what makes them so cool, Ryan? <gasps> Inside. Inside, there are 12, that's right, 12 secret magic tricks that you, Ryan, you are going to be able to use to go home and fool your friends. Using items you'll find around the house, things like Crazy glue, microwave ovens, razor blades, you know, stuff like that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that's my pal Ryan. Give him a big round of applause. Thank you, buddy. Woo!